we just can't wait to get it open. And this is the beginning. Fencing now surrounds the vacant Sears on the southern edge of Oxmoor Center. So definitely there's the thrill piece of, of seeing movement forward. It's the first step in making Top Golf in Louisville a reality. The project remained in limbo for months after Hearstbourne residents who were worried about lighting, noise, and traffic filed a lawsuit. They challenged the decisions of the city's planning commission and Metro Council to approve the necessary zoning change. In June, a circuit court judge ruled in favor of Top Golf. So the record, the ruling, the legal history and the facts are all in our favor. Kendall Merrick, the general manager of Oxmoor Center, says Topgolf is confident the judge's ruling will stand and the company has already filed for demolition permits and begun looking for a contractor. It's our goal to have the entire community uh, really enjoy this project. Now the old Sears building will come down to make way for the main part of the facility and then this parking lot will become the field. It's about time. Some Hurstboard and residents like J.G. Abel support bringing Top Golf to Oxmoor. Play golf and my daughter's a golfer, the whole family's a golf golfing family, so it'll be fun. We're excited about it. Plus, it, it's better than a dead mall. Merrick says Topgolf hopes to meet with those who still oppose the new venue in the hopes of finding a resolution. Let's sit across the table and find out what some of their concerns are and see if we can work on those together. Denny Camper, WLKY News.